Kels, firstly, how was Saturday adapting to a new formation, a new sort of way of playing? Obviously, you partnered Ethan in midfield. Just talk to me a little bit about Saturday. Yeah, it was good. Um, I think Jim spoke about it in his after the game, just about how there was a lot of information that week. Um, obviously, with the way Jim wants to play. Um, yeah, a lot of information, but I think the boys obviously took it on board well. Um, of course, it was still a lot to improve and learn from it, and yeah. Um, but I think the main thing is this: it's an enjoyable uh, way of playing, um, so that makes it obviously easier to sort of want to learn. And um, yeah, I think every, everyone's just taking it in their stride, um, and yeah, everyone's really looking forward to the games ahead. In that short space of time, you've sort of managed to adapt that and take it in Saturday. Obviously, you got three points as well, and it was shown in the goal, a lot of passes in the build. Has it been something that you guys have easily been able to adapt to and learn to? Has Jim made that very sort of understandable for you guys? Yeah, definitely. Um, I think the way Jim wants to play is a passing game. Um, I think that's why a lot of us are here, because obviously under the... Obviously, Robbie was sort of a similar style where it was a lot of... I mean, building phases, building from the back. Um, so I think a lot of us are suited to that, um, and that's the way everyone wants to play. Um, so yeah, everyone took it in their stride, and yeah, it was good. And how's the week been? Obviously, it's been a bit of a different week rather than focusing on Saturday, focusing on Friday, and then Monday. What's the week been like? And you know, has the lads sort of mood been risen a bit from those three points? We pretty much get back to work now. Yeah, it was. Um, of course, after Saturday, everyone was upbeat. Um, but obviously everyone knows the position we're in. Um, but again, Jim spoke about it, it's one game at a time. Again, we've got one Friday, so everything is sort of gunning towards that. Um, rather than looking ahead, it's focusing on Warsaw on Friday. And yeah, it's been, been a good week, a couple of days training, one more tomorrow, and then yeah, everyone will be looking forward to the game. So what's your thoughts ahead of Warsaw? So you've got a, you mentioned to me you've got a meeting later on. I won't get you to tell me what that's going to be about, but we saw the sort of pre-match preps going into that now. What sort of general feeling ahead of Walsall now? Yeah, you know, um, I think now it's mainly just focusing on ourselves, how we're going to play. Um, obviously, we do a little bit on them, how they play, how we can sort of go up against that. But I think a lot of our focus, like, like on Saturday, was how we're going to play, how we're going to do... Um, how we're going to play and things like that and obviously if we get that right we know we can sort of play up against anyone so I think that's the main focus. And Jim's very much focused on the next game, believes we can win any game. Two wins across the Easter weekend would be, would be huge because obviously there's, there's other factors that play into that as well but how, how huge would that be? Three points on Friday followed by three points on Monday. Yeah definitely, um, obviously everyone knows the situation we're in. Um, and yeah, we can only concentrate on ourselves, but going sort of back to back wins would be massive. Even on Friday from Saturday would be massive. Um, just not only just obviously for the lead table, but for confidence in the lads. Uh, you know, I mean, it's been it's been a tough season for everyone, but to go yeah, sort of two wins over the Easter weekend would be yeah, would be really good. And yeah, you just never know where it would leave us going into the remaining sort of five games. But yeah, like we said, it's mainly focused on Friday and after Friday we focus on Monday. And just a final point, we've been away from home for a few weeks now, we've had good following at Crawley and then again at Wimbledon. What sort of your, your message to the fans that, that, that are going to be there on, on Friday is pretty much get behind the boys and you guys are doing the business on the pitch, but they, they play an important part too. Yeah, all season they've played an important part. We've had some really good home games where like they've given us that sort of extra boost. Um, Swindon was, the atmosphere was unreal. Um, so yeah, it'll just be the same. Obviously, it's a Easter weekend as well, so everyone's sort of off work and sort of know we might get an extra big, bigger crowd. And, and yeah, just looking forward to seeing everyone there.